Hey everybody, it's VA Nurse 09. Okay, you guys, it is Monday wash day for me. And I told you guys that um, I'm on my operation, Real Edges back, right? Well, let me tell you guys what I'm doing. I have not ordered my Jamaican black castor oil yet. Because I gotta wait till I get some money. <laughs> but, um, what I'm doing in, uh, for the time being is I'm starting off with my castor oil and I mix some castor oil and my rosemary essential oil together. Now you could either use um, rosemary oil, peppermint oil, tea tree oil. They all kind of give you the same effect. So once or twice a day, I probably should be doing this twice a day, I just put a little bit on my edges and I massage. And that is basically what I'm going to be doing. I think I'm going to do like maybe a three month challenge, see if I can get these, these edges to grow back. But I'm going to give you guys a starting point. I know my hair looks crazy, but I did a, um, I'm doing a hot oil treatment. I'm doing that every week for this fall and, and winter uh, season because it's just this cold air just wreaks havoc on this type of hair y'all and like this morning it was 32 degrees which is extremely cold so gotta protect your hair you guys so basically what I did is I melted um, coconut oil because my hair loves coconut oil uh, it's extra virgin coconut oil and I melted some jojoba oil and each week I'm going to be trying different oil combinations to just kind of see which ones I like because I love oil y'all of course you know castor oil is my favorite but I don't do uh, I don't typically do um, my hot oil treatments with castor oil because it's a real heavy oil these two oils are supposed to be really good for penetrating the hair shaft so that's why I chose those two for this week so yeah I put that all over my hair hair started from tip and worked my way up toward the root and um, I'm going to go ahead and get my heating cap, sit under that, well not sit under, but put my heating cap on for a little bit, probably about 15 minutes, take that off, and then I will um, proceed to co-washing my hair, all that good stuff. So, anyway, I just wanted to give you guys a little update. I'm going to take some pictures of my edges so we can keep up with what's going on, y'all. But if any of you guys want to join me... Uh, feel free. I'm looking at it like I know I'm 40 now and all, but uh, no, the edges, mm -mm, we gotta get them to grow back. That's not no. Ain't working, no. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hey everybody, it's VA Nurse 09. Okay, I just finished my um, steam treatment. This week, you guys know, uh, usually with my conditioners, I kind of rotate different conditioners and I have main ones that I use uh, mainly uh, Aubrey Organics but this week after I did my high oil treatment I use my hydrating shea aloe creamy conditioner by Coles by Nature it's a really good conditioner too I haven't used it in a while um, I was using it early this summer but since I started using the Aubrey Organics I kind of stopped but this is really nice really nice creamy conditioner and this morning I, I told you guys on my Black Friday haul I just purchased some stuff from Curl Mart I purchased my Jesse Curl deep uh, conditioning weekly deep conditioning treatment two bottles of this it kinda sucked I got this from Curl Mart but you know these people were not having a sale now I know usually you know on their website they'll give you like 15% off, especially if it's like your first um, purchase or whatnot. But they won't have to sell. I was shocked. I was really really shocked. Um, yeah, this is a new packaging. It's really nice. This is a staple of mine. I use this every week. But with oh, let me tell you guys another thing. I use this uh, as my. Um, no, not honeysuckle rose. I use the uh, white camellia for my uh, deep conditioning this week. Um, yeah. 
So this this should last me a little bit of time. Um, let's see. Also, you guys, they sent me this product as like a sample. Now I've been wanting to try this. Okay, so it's a nice thing. They sent me this um, Jesse Curl uh, Touche Extra Moisturizing Conditioner. Y'all, <laughs> I just pH tested this. Any water-based product, I will pH test because I know what I can put in my hair and what I can't. This came back at a 6. You guys look at this. See, what you do, you kind of dip your product, dip, dip the strip in your product, and you kind of compare. Now, this is at a 6. Which really, really, really sucks. But that's going to save me some money because um, products that are at a 6 don't work for my hair. Uh, best products for my hair usually work between a 4 and a 5 at the highest. Maybe a 5.5 depending on how the ingredients are placed uh, in that particular conditioner or leave-in or whatever. Um, but uh, that's way too high. I, I, I ain't even gonna melt. And it, it really sucks because I've been wanting to try that product. I said, oh, I got me a sample, you know. That sucks. But save me some money because, like I said, um, products that are that high, it's like that as I am, is like at a six. That just does not, that pH is way too high for my hair. Anyway, that sucks. But, uh, <laughs> Anyway, my hair feels very, very soft. Oh my god, y'all, but y'all see the shrinkage? Crazy. Gotta love it. It is what it is, y'all. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put my Kimmy tube on, leave in, and uh, de detangle my hair and figure out what I'm gonna do this week. Alright, talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hey, everybody, it's VA Nurse 09. Okay, you guys, I finished up my hair and I uh, basically just did some flat twist uh, I blew my hair out so this is a this is a dry flat twist and uh, yeah um, I used the Sephora Beauty this is a Shea Avocado hair pomade Nice stuff. I, I I use both her products today, and uh, but I use this one to do the twist because I know it's got the um, carnubia uh, vegetable wax, so I know it would have a little bit more of a hole. But yeah, so this is how it turned out. Our hair is very soft. It's very shiny, which I love. So. I'm going to come back at you guys tomorrow and um, or whenever I take my twist out and show you what this looks like. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hey, everybody. It's VA Nurse 09. Okay, y'all. Back to work tonight. So I'm going to go ahead and take my flat twist down and see how this looks. Just using some of my Shea Butter Mix. You know, I have learned that it's actually... Well, I have to see, because when I um take down the, the single strand twist, I start up here. But it might be a little bit different when you're working with uh, when you're working with flat twist. So we'll see how this ends up. Yeah, working a little overtime tonight.
So I'm going to go ahead and take these down and I will get back with you guys after I'm done. Hey everybody, it's VA Nurse 09. Okay you guys, so I'm back. I haven't finished completely fluffing out my hair. But this is what I have initially. Of course I gotta do something with this part here. I made some individual two strand twists up in this area to kind of hide that a little bit. But um, this is what I have so far. Um, if you guys remember I used the Support Beauty um, Shea Avocado Hair Pomade. Sorry about that you guys, my darn camcorder cut off. Okay, so like I was saying, if you guys remember, I used my Shea Avocado Hair Pomade by Sport Beauty to do my twist. And it, it really has good definition. This is a pretty good product. And uh, I also used my Kimmy Tube. And um, I used the Delight My Hair Butter to seal the ends. Yeah, so I'm just... Um, I'm going to have to work with this a little bit more. And I don't know if I want to fluff it out more or just what the heck I'm going to do. But I'll get back with you guys in just a little bit. Hey everybody, it's VA Nurse Online. Okay, you guys, this is the finished look that I came out with. Um, I actually really, really like this twist out. Um, my hair is very, very soft. It's fluffy. It's, you know, it's got a little movement there, you know. Um, it's nice. This, this pomade's Pretty good, man. Anyway, yeah, so this is the final look. I'll turn around and let you guys see. Only part, I had this part was actually originally on this side. I couldn't get the darn piece of hair to jab right, so I just put a little bobby pin over there. And I guess I'll just wear it um, on this side tonight. Anyway, hope you guys have a great night, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Hey everybody, it's VA Nurse 09. Y'all, I think this has been one of the best twist outs I have had in a long time. Let me turn around and y'all take a look. I don't think I've ever seen my hair this big, but this twist out is so nice. I mean, my hair is like well defined, it's fluffy. I mean, y'all. I'm just tripping. I'm just seriously tripping off of my hair. Well, I just had to come back and tell y'all. I need to find a way to keep this twist out for at least a couple days. So I don't know what the heck I'm going to do, but I got to come up with something. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon.